how do these meds impact lean mass and what should people be doing besides strength training to preserve mass if they've been on them? We're talking about fat loss, but I feel like the conversation is a little bit off when it comes to muscle and lifestyle changes. The thing that we know right now that is the most important is strength training. In my patients, when we give at least like two days a week of like good resistance training, the fat-free mass loss or the muscle losses are minimal to none. Sometimes they gain fat-free mass. Protein is important, but it's not as important as the resistance training. Because you're, you know, it's an appetite suppressant, you're eating a little bit less. Does that hinder some of your workouts? Like, do you feel not as fueled or do you you know, get to a certain point where you just don't have the strength to push harder? Yeah. So this happens in more advanced exercisers. Beginners don't notice. They're like, I feel like hell all the time. And so like you give them help and lose weight. They all of a sudden feel so much better that you start exercising them. They don't know the difference type of thing. They feel better overall. 